Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today we are watching the 1955 American animated musical romance film, uh, film Lady and a Tramp. If you haven't seen this movie, it, uh, I think it's a very nice movie to watch. So on Christmas evening in the year 1909, in a quaint western town, Jim Deere gives his wife Darling, I like his last name, Jim Deere, a cocker spaniel puppy which they name Lady. Lady enjoys a joyful life with the couple and befriends two local neighborhood dogs, a Scottish terrier named Chuck and a bloodhound named Trusty. Meanwhile, across town, a stray mutt named Tram lives on his own, dining on scraps from Tony's Italian restaurant and protecting his fellow strays, pack and bull, from the local dog catcher. One day, Lady is upset after her owner's breeding, treating her rather coldly. Jock and Trusty visits her a determined that their behavior changed due to Darling expecting a baby. While Jock and Trusty tries to explain what a baby is, Tram interrupts the conversation and offers his own thoughts on the matter making Jock and Trusty take an immediately immediate dislike to the stray and order him out of the yard. As Tram leaves, he reminds Lady that when the baby moves in, a dog moves out. Eventually, the baby arrives and the couple introduces Lady to the infant, of whom Lady becomes very fond and protective over. When Jim and Darlene leaves on for a vacation, they put their dog, hating aunt Sarah, in charge of the baby in the house. Why do you leave your newborn child with your aunt and not take him? And so, and then somehow Lady was thrown out the house and got captured by the dog snatcher the dog catcher I mean and brought to the local pound while at the pound the other dogs revealed to Lady that Tram has had a multiple girlfriends in the past and they feel it is unlikely that he will ever settle down Lady is eventually claimed by Aunt Sarah who chains her in the backyard as punishment for running away Jordan Trusty visits and tries to comfort Lady, but when Tramp arrives to apologize, Lady berates him for having other girlfriends in the past and his failure to rescue her from the pub. And Tramp leaves sadly, but immediately thereafter, a rat sneaks into the house. Lady sees the rat and barks frantically at it. And Sarah tells her to be quiet. Tram hears her barking and rushes back, entering the house and cornering the rat in the nursery. Lady breaks free and rushes to the nursery where Tram inadvertently knocks over the baby's crib before ultimately killing the rat. The commotion alerts Aunt Sarah, who thinks they have harmed the baby. She pushes Tram into the closet and locks Lady in the basement. Then they call the pound to take Tram away. Jim and Darlene return home as the dog catcher departs. When they release Lady, she leads them to the dead rat. Overhearing everything, Trusty and Chuck chases after the dog catchers and the dogs track down the wagon and scare the horses, causing the wagon to crash. Jim arrives in a taxi with Lady who reunites with Tram, but the wagon almost kills Trusty. The Christmas, that Christmas, Tram has been adopted by the family, 
and he and the lady had started their own family with their little four puppies. John comes to see the family and trustee who recovered merely suffered from a broken leg and are formally welcomed as guests by the humans. And thanks to the puppies, trustee has fresh audience for his old stories, but he has forgotten them.